Good morning, Wolves! Happy Monday! It is March 21st, and last week before spring break, yeah, let's give it up. So let's get this started. Here we have athletic announcements. This I um, both teams' seasons are undefeated by boys volleyball playing against um, Adam Brook. Saturday game against Bright Byers today after school starting at 4.30, come on and cheer on. Wolves play against Montague and one four to zero. Girls soccer our game at 4.30. Come support our Lady Wolves. Okay. Hi, so look out. Wolves of the World will be hosting a fundraiser after spring break where one lucky winner will be able to shave Mr. Hand's head into whatever design they want. This was consensual. Just making sure. <laughs> right, for 10th grade, a reminder for all you 10th graders at last Friday's morning meeting, uh, we're doing an advisory competition. So the advisory with the least refocuses and the most improvement with getting the least uh, refocuses will have a chance to win a whole advisory prize. That could be pizza party, donut party, whatever you want. Students who receive no refocuses will be automatically entered into a raffle to win prizes as well. So that could be gift cards, lunches, snacks, whatever you want. So let's start this week off strong and get no refocuses. And for juniors, make sure to submit the summer program form, whether it be QuestBridge, that engineering one that I have no idea what it's called. And congratulations to all of you who got into summit. Yay. Yes, um, 12th grade, Keaton sent uh, all of us an email to vote on the prom theme, so make sure you go and vote. And also check your email to see your doctor's appointment. Mm -hmm. oh, yes. okay. So club announcements, GSA is proud to announce that they will be hosting the Day of Silence on Thursday, April 21st. What is Day of Silence? Day of Silence is a national student-led demonstration where LGBTQ students and allies all around the country and the world as well take a vow of silence to protest the harmful effects of harassment and discrimination of the LGB people in schools. Uh, more information will be provided in the coming days. Right, and with our weekly weather report, we're starting off our first uh, week before spring break with snow, of course, we got to get that over with. Uh, it's going to be during the morning with transition snow showers in the afternoon. High around 40, we have a low of 28, we have winds blowing, uh, occasionally could gust to 40 miles per hour, so make sure you're being careful when you walk up to the lunchroom. Uh, a windy day on Tuesday, high 45, low 32. On Wednesday, we have sun coming out, still scattered clouds, um, 70 miles per hour for wind, so not as bad. Uh, Thursday, we have a bright and sunny day, high 61, low 35. And on Friday, we're kicking it off. Maybe not as good as Thursday, but you know, it's spring break. You can't complain. High 66, low 44, mostly sunny. Hi guys. Um, suggestion box highlight. So update. We got more suggestions that the home game should be free. And we talked to Slaughter about it. And pretty much we need some profit so that we can, the school can be reimbursed with the money they spend on athletics. So we were trying to find a compromise and pretty much students only have to pay $1 for home games. If you guys bring your student ID, so it went from $3 to $1. Um, keep leaving suggestions. It's been slowing down a bit, but we greatly appreciate it. <laughs> student spotlight um, from last week was Joshua Griego. Griego. Uh, for his participation and work completion this week. Good job in Spanish. Spanish is hard, so. <laughs> Other, um, we mentioned the student council run drive a lot, and that's still happening. We have a set date, which is going to be around the end of April, because there's a lot of plans happening during that time. So keep an eye out for that and make sure you pile up stuff to donate. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Make sure to go to the buyers game today. They're our nemesis, so let's beat them. Let's get this audience going. Only one dollar and have a great week. Last week before spring break. Yeah. Well, if I'm not your thing, you can go to the girls' soccer game too.
Yeah. Or if you want volleyball. <laughs> <laughs>